Hello everyone. In this video, we will see how to calculate the frequency of words in a given string. Right. So we are calculating the frequency of words in a given string. Right. So let me create a variable. So I will say, how are you? Maybe, where are you? How is your work going on? Call me on. And so for you, right? So now <coughs> I need to find how many times this how is occurring, or is occurring, you is occurring, right? So the the first thing we need to do is the very important thing is we need to uh, convert the capital letters into the lower case. Why? So if you see, we have how and how two times it is coming, right? We know strings right so and also we talked about the double equal to it will give the boolean value whether true or false so it says these two are not equal to right they are not equal to because h is a capital and here h is a, uh, the lower lower uh, letter right so we always need to convert all the letters into the lower case right when we are doing any string processing or whatever right it is good idea to convert to the lower case right so obviously right so when i say how double equal to how it is true right so this is the reason why we are converting to the lower case and another important thing is we need to take only the characters we here here we are doing the frequency of the words right and we have some number here we have some special character obviously we need to remove it so in string there is a uh, function called is alpha which will tell you if you have only alphabets or anything else if it is a false which means it it has other than the alphabets right so <clears throat> we can use a regular expression to remove the unwanted uh, things in a given string so i'll make a separate video on the regular expression but you know to get only the alphabets from the given string this is the regular expression we use so what we are doing is boss take alphabet from capital a to uh, sorry small a to capital sorry small a to small z and capital a to capital z right and this is my string and wherever you find you know the non alphabets then just you know the replace with the space now if you see the text did you see yeah there is a space here in string we have you know the another uh, method called strip t you know did you see this it removed the unwanted space it removed the unwanted space on the left side or the right side not in the middle by the way right now the next thing we need to do is obviously we need to convert right so all our alphabets into the lower case you see now this how is converted to the lower case now we know what to do we need to calculate the word frequency here the very first what i am doing is i am taking the unique values from the given test how to take a unique values from a given text first we need to convert to the list and then we can use set set is one of the data type where you know you'll it will always uh, stores the unique value we'll see we know how to create a list right from a given string we have an option called split right what split does i am saying split this text with the space did you see we got a list now i need a unique value out of this so I can say set of LST. Let me see you and I. Yeah. So these are the unique values. Right? So we have must have some extra space here. Did you see? We have an extra space. Maybe because of this. Let me run like this. Right, it's gone now okay now this is this is a set actually right so if you if you see this 
data type this is set let me you know convert it back to the list we know it's called type casting right as you know it's a list now what i'll do is i'll create an empty dictionary so in my dictionary i store boss or is occurring one time maybe how is occurring two times right so i'm storing my results in a dictionary so this is for i in u sorry u and i which is my unique variable right so here what i'm doing is so d of i which is here i'm creating a key in case of i very first time it is r second time me in the third iteration view and so on right so in list we have another uh, you know uh, metrical count lst which is my list here this list dot count it will tell you how many times it is occurring so i so very first time i is r second time me is third time r and so on right now if i print my dictionary did you see r is coming two time how is coming two time u is coming two time right on is coming two times right so this is how you know you can print the word frequency count so there is very simple and easy way which we can do with uh, one of the metrical counter so we have a concept called collection frameworks in python right I'll again I'll, I'll make a separate video for that but for for this demo right so uh, so we have a package called collection which comes by default python installation inside that we have counter right so for this counter i need to send a list right so this will tell you how many times each word is occurring right so if you ask, ask me this is the efficient way to you know uh, find the counts the reason why we did is just to understand you know uh, all those things right so like for loop few of the you know uh, methods called count etc right so hope you uh, enjoy this video so please don't forget to subscribe to my channel thank you